Hi, I'm JD, and this is the problem that we're going to be doing today. You have a relation, a set of, of points, and first you're to determine, okay, is it a function? Second, and thirdly, what's its domain range? So if you would, uh, answer those questions and see if you try to do, one, do this one on your own. All right. <clears throat> So what we have is a relationship, right? A relation, and it's a series of points, x, y, x, y, x, y, x, y. Now, let me show you visually what happens to determine if it's a function or not. Visually speaking, if it fails the vertical line test, like this sideways parabola right here, just in one point, if it intersects more than once the vertical line at any point, then it fails the vertical line test. So here, it would fail the vertical line test because for one, it's with one as being x, the y is not unique. You either have two or three. Now, visually speaking, if I was to plot these points, it would fail the vertical line test, right? This is one comma two, which is right here. This is one comma three. See that? Visually speaking, it would fail the vertical line test because it intersects the vertical line at more than one point. If it's one or less, it's fine. Now the other guys are fine. So rule of thumb, if you see a set and the X is repeated, it doesn't matter if the Y is repeated, but if the X is repeated and there's a unique, in other words, the Y's are different, then it is not a function. So the answer to the first question is no, it is not a function. All right, so second, what's its domain? Domain is all the x's, all possible x values. So it'd be one, one, I only have to list that one twice, four and six. So it'd be one, four, and six for domain. For its range, the range is all possible y values. So it would be 2, 3, 5, and 7. 2, 3, 5, and 7. If it's not in order, a range is so it is in order for a domain range. And that's it.